Hi, my name is Jim from printableflashcards.com. In this video, I'm going to do my best to present what this uh, study flashcard toolbar uh, can do. First of all, I'm in Firefox. This toolbar can also be installed as an extension add-on to Chrome and to Internet Explorer. Here, again, is an add-on to Firefox. That's what I'm using. So this here is the toolbar. It's broken up into several uh, categories. This is where you make your flashcards and print them. You got languages, mathematics, science, history, learning resources, which you have you can study for your SAT test, AP test, and several other things that are in here. And also, you can use your email, go to Facebook. You can't see it on the screen, but off to the right, you have a ask. You can ask questions like you see here in, in Google. And of course, you have the toolbar where you can enable or disable the toolbar or uninstall it altogether. Okay, so what happens? When you click on any of these uh, categories, a, the main screen will open up with subcategories. For example, if I go to uh, uh, languages, you see a subset of uh, categories come up. And the subset is in every one of these major categories. So what's in the subsets, science and uh, medicine, for example, you have life science, physical science, earth science, and the mathematics, you have arithmetic, time, geometry. These are all the different flashcards. For history, you got the US and, and world history. And in languages and culture, you got different languages you can uh, study in English, Spanish, French, Mandarin, and also sign language. Okay, so besides picking a category here, like I just said, a, 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 a category broken down into uh, sub flashcard sets, you can also scroll down to the bottom and pick. Uh, a category by alphabetical order, or alphabetical, I should say. For example, if I pick G, there's nothing there. Okay, let's pick F. Okay, F, we have vitamins. We got flags, family and relationships. This is in Spanish. This is in France. If we pick uh, another one, it also has related stuff, like for the vitamins, nutrition, health, medical, and food. If we pick a different one, let's say like weather or W, we got weather conditions, 13 cards and that. Uh, what is time? 48 cards, also broken down the telling time, counting, elementary and images, and uh, it just goes on and on. If I pick D's, yeah, I can show you this. This is uh, the D's are for division. And many, many of these sets, windows, you can click on Show More, and it will just continue. I uh, hear Days of the Week is in Mandarin and English. So that's all they have for the, for the Ds. But anyway, the moral of the story is you can pick on these by, uh, by alphabetical order, not uh, by category order, like they are up here. Okay, so. How do we uh, view these things? We'll just stay here in the division. If I want to study these cards, I just click on uh, the study. This is for online study. And we'll ask the question. 1 divided by 0 equals what? Should be 0. Or that is, you cannot divide by 0. And to verify your answer, you click on it, cannot divide. You go to the next one. 1 divided by 1 equals what? Oh, I don't know. 
Well, you click on here. Oh, one of course. And it just continues on for 119 cards. Now, from here, you have a couple of options. You can go ahead and print out the the, the 119 card set. But if you don't know, if you want to know what they look like uh, before you print them, you just go ahead to the preview mode. Here, it shows you what's on the uh, first card, front page, or the front side of the card. Over here shows you what's on the back side of the card. And for card number two, card number three, and so forth, all the way through uh, the 119, I think it said. Anyway, once you're satisfied this is what you want, you just click the download. And a PDF will come up and tell you how to print it out. It will also tell you that all the even pages is the questions. And they're broken up four cards per page. And then the odd uh, uh, pages are the answers. And so for this example, we have 61 pages will be printed out with all those uh, questions and answered on them. And then once you're happy, you just click over here and click the print button and it will print it out. Or you can go up, you can go up here, you can't see it on my screen. You go up up to the very top and you can save it as a PDF either way. But your intent was to print it out, so you'd be going over here anyway. Okay, so that's how you, you create it. Okay, now let's go and talk about uh, creating your own flashcards. So you click on that, and this uh, window will open up. And uh, in this pane here, you type in your question. Uh, what is my my name? I'd like to point out real quick that in the styles here, you can pick a color. You can pick the size. Uh, you can pick bold. A lot of stuff you can do. You can even center it. And uh, over here is where you put the answer. Same story, you got styles you can play with. Uh, what is my name? Jim. And once you're ready, you add a card. Now you're ready for the second card. These are the ones you're creating yourself, remember. Uh, what, what color is your car? The answer? is gray. And then when you're ready, you move on to the third card. And so you go on and on and on. Now if you wanted more than one card set, you would have to save this. Give it a name. And then you create a new new one and give it a name and you just repeat what you just did. Now once you're ready and get all your cards made and ready to, to study online or print them, you just click here, create flashcards. And now you're back in these two modes again. This is the study mode, which it asks you can read the question, what is my name? Uh, Jim. She'll answer if I'm correct. Yes, I am. What color is my car? Darn, I don't know. I'll click this. Gray. Well, of course it's gray. And then you move on to the next one. And you just keep going to go through all your, your cards in, in that set. Now from here, you could go ahead and print them out if you want, or go to the preview mode and see what the cards would look like before you print them. And then once you're happy, again, you go over here to download, and it tells you about it. And here's the, uh, the two cards we made for the questions, even uh, pages, and the answer is on the odd page. And here they are. And so that's how you work with this two bar. And um, my family and I really enjoy it. And I think it's worthwhile for anybody with kids or if you're in school to uh, use this two bar. It's free. Just uh, uh, click on the big red button, orange button that you see uh, 
on the page that this video is on and download it. And again, and again I think you really like it and get some real use out of it. Again, my name is Jim Burrow from CreatePrintingFlashcards.com.